wanted to share a short clip about a wrist patient I just saw. This is one for the um, hand and wrist lovers. Um, a patient came to me with a um, dorsal wrist complaint after a uh, trauma two weeks ago with skiing. The exact uh, accident she didn't quite remember. Um, of course, uh, I checked for the SL ligament if it was intact, the arm was intact, and her pain was more located in uh, this region. Um, so we made a scan of her uh, joint space between her first metacarpal and her trapezoid over there. And I made a the long axis view. So this is the orientation of the probe that you will be seeing in the images. So here we go. Here's the image. I'm moving around a bit so it's not uh, quite clear yet. Here it comes. So this is the, yeah, there you see the metacarpal. This is the trapezoid. Here's the joint space. I have the Doppler on so you can actually see that there is some Doppler activity in the dorsal region. Now I'm a bit on the trapezium. Yeah, here we go, trapezoid again. Uh, you see some around where the ligament uh, usually is, you see some uh, overactivity and you see some uh, hypoechoic areas within the joint space. Also note the thickening, oh that's a pity, notice the thickening of the soft tissues just above the joint space. Um, here you can see the same image uh, when she's doing something that provokes her pain, she's making a pinch movement. So she's doing this while I scan her dorsal wrist. And notice that the joint space in between the metacarpal over here, the trapezoid over there, here she starts pinching. I think, yeah, there we go. You see that uh, that's a bit lax. Usually this joint is really, really, um, there's no movement at all in this area. So. Of course I made for you guys an image of the contralateral side. Here you see the normal wrist, you see the metacarpal, trapezoid, you see the ligamentous structures over here which are hyperechoic um, and you see no widening of the joint space while she makes the pinching movement. Also note that the um, soft tissue above it, there's no uh, thickening of this and no hypoechoic areas. Hope you like the case.